So welcome to this tutorial on how to use drag and frame. The first thing we're going to do, as we always do, is we need to make sure that when we create our new project that we save it in a specific place on our external drive. So once you've opened up drag and frame, you're going to create a new scene. And the, the, the this is a little bit weird. The production, you're only allowed to put in up to eight um, letters. So I'm just going to call this demo. Um, and then the scene, you can just keep as one. Most of you are not going to do multiple scenes. Drag and Frame is really set up to be used in uh, professional movie production and stuff like that. So this would be to keep um, in sync with like the call sheet or the scene sheet that you were doing. And then it's going to ask where to set it. I'm going to set it on my external drive in Time Arts, and I'm going to create a new folder. calling this one animation demo, but just make sure you give it a good name and then hit save. 